Hi guys, today we're talking about circular motion. What is circular motion? When a force is applied perpendicular to the direction of an object's motion, the object will undergo circular motion. The moon orbits the earth in a circular path because the force of gravity is always at right angles to the moon's motion. So we can see uh, the red arrow, well that's the direction of the force, the force vector always acting towards the earth and the direction of velocity, the purple arrow, is always 90 degrees uh, to the direction of the force. So this is why we get a circular motion. So what causes circular motion? Well the force on the object acts towards the center and causes a constant change of velocity towards the center of the circular path. So here we can just see part of our circular path. Uh, we've got an object and it's at position A and then it's going to move to position B. And we can think, well, at each of these points in time, uh, we can imagine the vector uh, for velocity. Well, this is the vector A. Uh, at the position A, what would the, what's the direction of the velocity? And then a very small amount of time later, it's moved on ever so slightly, and the direction of the vector has changed. So now it's the velocity vector B. And what caused that change? Well, there's a very small delta V, a change in velocity, and then that acts towards the center of our uh, circle. And then that's caused by the force. Okay guys, well I hope that explanation has been useful for you. Uh, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Okay, bye for now guys.